Hey everyone, it's James Lambert, the motivational coach and speaker. I went from knockouts to knowledge and from headlocks to hugs. I still embrace people just now in a more positive way. So I thought it was about time I did one of these. I've been all over Periscope doing my daily motivational videos on my YouTube channel and Twitter elsewhere and so what I really wanted to talk about just for a few short moments was the importance that having a positive mindset has on your life and to put this in context I haven't always been as positive as I am today I, uh, I used to have a very bad case of what I call stinking thinking and it was a terribly negative, pessimistic attitude. And interestingly enough, because I held that internally in my thoughts, I then went out into the world and created a whole scenario of events. I met people and places and the environment I entered into confirmed my beliefs. And this is what's so interesting, how your beliefs can actually affect, may create your reality. I find it incredibly interesting. And again, furthermore, since I've begun to think more positively, to focus on the good in life, the happiness, abundance, joy, peace, harmony, kindness, compassion, love, ultimately, all of these wonderful things, it's not a coincidence. My life has changed beautifully for the better. And so I just recall briefly when I was young, so I'd get up and my goodness, talk about the diet of champions. It wasn't, you know, occasionally I did used to smoke, you know, start off the day with a cigarette, several cups of coffee. And again, I put this in context, it's not how you treat yourself. It starts with the thoughts and that literally the diet you consume, it all affects your state of mind and well-being. I wasn't treating myself well in the internal self-talk and then again in how I was eating. So again, that, that's the context, the breakfast wasn't great. I went out, I remember it used to start up very early, get into, the, into an argument with the bus driver. You know, he'd complained about the kind I'd give him. He's going, oh, is that a real... Now, this is what's so interesting. It was a real currency, but because of my, I believe my, my, my stinking thinking, energetically, we used to butt heads, literally and, and figuratively, uh, unfortunately. And, you know, an argument would ensue, and then uh, on and on it would go. Or another young man would catch my eye, walking down into Catford, South East London. Another argument, or it would all kick off, all because of my state. Now, I was completely unaware of this at the time. I did used to wonder, you know, I wonder what's going on, why am I attracting this? But I never once knew or acknowledged that it started with me and it was very very difficult in many ways because it's like wading through treacle without a paddle you know you're going through the storms of life and you don't know how to change conversely again focusing on the positive it's not that all the negative people have disappeared literally however we're not almost energetically compatible and so i don't notice them and this is what's very interesting. I've spoke before about, um, hey, oh, hey, Pete, nice to see you. Nice to see you. I hope you're very well. I'm very well. And you're just talking about, it's almost like the radio you tune into. So before I was into, say, maybe radio negativity. And so I picked up on that and others around me did. Today, it's almost like radio good times or positive vibes. Lo and behold, my interactions with others are all very much more positive. So I just want to, in closing, encourage you to stick with a positive attitude because it really does have a multitude of benefits. Now, whether that's in your business, whether that's in your personal relationships, indeed in all one's relationships, having a positive attitude, it will help from the moment you wake up in the morning. You know, talk about getting off on the right foot, getting out of bed on the right side, think positively as you take the same care hopefully to dress yourself choose an attitude of gratitude choose to be thankful choose to be appreciative of that which you do have you know your friends your loved ones a job to go to all of these things when you focus on them it's almost as if the things you get to be grateful for increases 
So start your day off right, treat yourself well, first and foremost in your thoughts. Talk to yourself kindly, internally, and treat yourself well, self-care, through your diet and so on, and focus on the good. So, I'll leave that there for now. I hope you're very, very well. Have a great day, and remember, you are unstoppable, and I believe in you.